I said, and pulled my hand quickly out of my tote bag. There's totally something pretty wrong with that finger. I was just looking at this dog on the street. It wasn't really doing anything, just dog stuff, keeping its tongue out and turning to different directions. I wasn't allergic to art, don't be silly, but I was allergic to dogs. And there was an art event for dogs that day. And I had forgotten to take my allergy meditations with me. And sometimes it's very easy to identify with dogs. I really had to remember to call a doctor for an appointment tomorrow first thing in the morning because I had accidentally scratched my finger when trying so hard to fall asleep. And as it was July, when everything gets infected, I was worried that this also would. Especially it's a problem with fingers, because they are always touching different things everywhere, like adorable little dogs in the different parks, and other fingers, and pizzas, and door handles, and mind controllers. It's funny how it works. The concentration, it comes in caves, now in waves, I thought, as I was sipping my organ, and it was almost like I could hear it, a tiny sobbing or a whining voice, with occasional muttering kind of sound, like words. I stood up, stretched my back and neck and legs, glad I had my stretch leggings on, because it would have been very difficult to stretch my legs if I had, for example, really tight jeans. I mean right-handed in most things. With some things it's strange how sometimes I have to think which hand to use for the head of the nail. There. I didn't want to touch any more dirty stuff with my fingers. But what about the rest of the nail? I thought to myself, privately, a bit embarrassed by the whole thought. I was sleeping things we should not disturb. Sometimes I feel you don't really see me. Maybe there's something in your eyes. Maybe you're just a bit tired. You don't see through it. You don't know what's on the other side. You feel there's something there. Do you remember the first time we went outside? It was a sunny feeling. No. Sorry. A funny feeling. It was too bright. Like in a forest. Thank you for thinking for me. You're welcome. I enjoy thinking for you so you don't have to do all of it by yourself. I like sharing the effort with you, and taking some of the burden off from your shoulders, off your backs, off Burton's backpacks, super fast chickens and bullet trains on your sexy six-year request hunger retreat in the beautiful northern islands of Japan. I like going to parks and outdoors and breathe around a few times and then come back inside. Inside what? Inside me. Inside houses. Rooms. <laughs>
här med MP Apple har visat sig vid Tilda och Forkling för ord som är hon älskar att ha en tämselvös. オンザリトルトレールインザフォレストスアンドオンザリトルトレールインザフォレストスアンドオンザリトルトレールインザフォレストスアンドオンザリトルトレールインザフォレストスアンドオンザリトル And on the little to rain in the forest, and on the little to rain in the forest, and on the little to rain in the forest.